A reading from the book of Tobit. Chapter 13 Then Tobit prayed, Praise the eternal God. Praise the one who rules. He punishes us, then he shows us mercy. He sends us down to the world of the dead, then he brings us up from the grave. No one can escape his power. People of Israel, give thanks among the nations, where he sent you to into exile. Even then, he showed you his great power. Let all who live hear your praise. The Lord is our God and Father forever. Though he punished you for your wickedness, he will be merciful and bring you home. From among the nations where he scattered you, turn to him with all your heart and soul. Live in loyal obedience to him. Then he will turn to you and help you and will no longer hide himself. Remember that God has done for you and give thanks with all your heart. Praise the righteous Lord, honour the eternal King. Although I live in exile in a foreign land, I will give thanks to the Lord and I will speak of his great strength to a nation of sinners. Turn away from your sins and do what pleases God. Perhaps he will be gracious and show you his mercy. I praise my God and rejoice in his greatness. My whole being honours the King of heaven. Let everything and everyone tell of his greatness and sing his praises in Jerusalem. Jerusalem, holy city of our God, he will punish you for the sins of your people. But he will be merciful to all those who do right. So give thanks to the Lord, for he is good. Praise the eternal King. Your temple will be rebuilt, and your people will be happy again. May the Lord make all your exiles glad. May he take care of your suffering people for as long as time shall last. Jerusalem, your light will shine brightly for all the world, and from far away many nations will come to you. Their people will come to honour the Lord your God. They will bring gifts for the King of Heaven. In your streets, many generations will sing joyful praise. In your name will endure forever as God's chosen city. A curse will be on all who make threats against you, on all who destroy you and tear down your walls, on all who demolish your towers and burn your homes but all who honour you will be blessed forever. Rejoice, Jerusalem, because of your righteous people. They will be gathered together from exile to praise the Lord of the ages. Happy are all those who love you and are pleased to see you prosper. Those who mourn over you, suffering now, will one day be happy. Your happiness will bring them joy forever. I praise the Lord, the great King. Jerusalem will be rebuilt and will be his home forever. Jerusalem, how happy I will be when my descendants can see your splendour and give thanks to the King of Heaven. Your gates will be built with sapphires and emeralds and your walls will be precious stones. Your towers will be made of gold and their fortifications of pure gold. Your streets will be paved with rubies and precious jewels. Joyful songs will ring out from your gates, and from all your houses people will shout, Praise the Lord, praise the Lord of Israel. Jerusalem, God will bless your people, and they will praise his holy name forever. With these words, Tobit ended his song of praise.